so this video is part two of my very big collective beauty haul. So you want to see part one, I was featuring Dior, Burberry, Elizabeth Arden, Hourglass. Anyways, I'll link it down below. First thing is um, from Clinique. It's actually bonus time in Clinique at Sears right now. So if you spend $31 or more, you'll get a little goodie bag. The first thing, well, the only thing that I purchased is this Clinique Redness Solution Soothing Cleanser with pri Probiotic Technology. So um, I wanted to get a exfoliant because I've been just needing one. Um, but then I was with my mom and she was like, is that good for sensitive skin? Because I have very sensitive skin and... Um, the girl at Chanel, uh, Chanel, why I keep saying Chanel? The girl at Clinique said it was better just to get this if I have very sensitive skin and redness on my cheeks. So she recommended this. Um, that was $27, which I thought was not that expensive. And then my mom got stuff, so that's why I was able to get this. They have the whole line, so if I really like this, I'll probably go get the the moisturizer. I'm really excited to see the difference and hope it works. Wrinkle correcting eye cream. But it comes with a lot of product. I've used it um, the past few days and it comes with so much but you need so little. So I was excited to get this for free. So I got this and then I got my favorite moisturizer which is the Dramatically Different Moisturizing, moisturizing Lotion. The Moisture Surge CC Cream which I'm excited to try this. Came with a mascara. Then um, the eyeshadow duo came in that packaging. I think it's kind of cute. And it um, it came with either this or it was green and brown. She was like, you, oh no, oh, oh no. It's in the color glaze, glazed berry. Yeah, it's kind of frosty a little bit, but it's a nice color. It's probably going to be nice for um, spring and summer. Okay, now I have two things from, I have a lot of things from Winners because they've been having really great stuff. I found so much NARS, I found Becca, I found... Chanel in my last haul. It's amazing winners. Okay, so I found two Becca cream blushes, which these are actually discontinued, but they're so nice. Like, they're very nice. And I'm, ever since I got these, I was like obsessed with cream blushes now. So, yeah. The first one I got is in Hastent. I don't really, is that kind of focus? I don't know, because as you can tell, it's a new camera. Um, I don't really know how it works, but I like it. Okay, so it looks like this. It's a very nice red so it looks like this i got this one which is wild orchid it's again a cream blush from becca and that one was 9.99 but this is the prettiest color it is so pretty it's very natural and they're so nice these cream blushes so it's a lot more purpley tone um it's very nice. I really like it. Winners have been receiving a lot of NARS stuff, and I love NARS, so I went a little crazy. So I got, like, every time I would go, I would pick one thing, but then the next day, not next day, but like next week, I would go back and just get the other thing. And then I should have just got everything at once, but I just went and bought something every time. Okay, the first one is a blush, and the fr like a week, no. Two months ago, I saw this and I was like, hell no. But then I saw videos on YouTube of people talking about this and I was just like, okay, I want it, but then I didn't want it. But anyways, I got it for $24.99, which is very good because they still sell this blush at Sephora. It's Exhibit A. It's, you'll see that new little screen. Looks like this. It's very nice. I love it. You need, like, you just tap your brush in there and you will get product. And I mean, I'm very fair, but it looks very nice on me. It's, I mean, it's kind of orange a little bit. It's a orangey red. So I love NARS blushes. So yeah, it looks like this. It's very, very nice. Um, I wore it once already and I really, really like it. have a, another blush. This one is in the color Nico. And again, it was $24.99. Um, this is a blush on Temptalia because I really like Temptalia's website because when I'm just looking for a product, I'll just go on her blog. And this one, she said it's either a color you're going to reach for every single day or just never. Um, which is kind of funny, but... And also, Gosh Makeup Artist talked about this and he said that it was best for fair skin, very fair skin. So I was like, it's perfect for me. So, as you can tell, it's very light. I mean, you can't really tell. I've liked it on top of cream blushes, but... 
on Temtalia, someone said that it looks great as a finishing powder in the comments. So I, I'm going to try this because it has slight shimmers, but it's not too intense at all. It's not really a highlight just on top of your cheekbone because it wouldn't show a lot. I mean, I'm going to play with this and I'm definitely going to tell you how I wear it. They still have this at Sephora for like 33 That's a um, Dual Cream Eyeshadow. This one is in the shade Madagascar. And um, it's my first try time trying um, NARS eyeshadows. And this one is in cream. Is it cream? So it looks like this. So um, I really, really like this shade. It's a very nice taupey color. My finger is all dirty. Um, and then this one is just a very natural um, like skin tone color. Which I like this one, but I really, really like the like topery, topery, the taupe color. It's very nice. It's $19.99, so that was good. Now I'm going to do Illa Masca. I was desperate, desperately looking for the cream, NARS cream blush in Penny Lane, but, and um, Cactus Flower, but they discontinued the cream blushes. I don't know why they did that, but anyways, I was looking everywhere for these. And actually at Winners, they received a few cream blushes, but they received Locum, Locum. They didn't have Penny Lane or Cactus Flower, but um, yeah, anyways, uh, I was looking on blogs, I was looking everywhere to buy this freaking blush, especially Penny Lane, I really, really wanted it, and I never actually saw it in real life, I just saw it online, but yeah, anyways, um, but then I found on the blog that um, Ila, Mas Ila Masca's Zy Zygomatic was a dupe. Last haul, I talked about the Hourglass blush in ethereal glow that I really like to pair with the cream blush. This is the cream blush. So it looks kind of blah. It's kind of a brownie color. Not brownie, but it's kind of a brown nude color. But okay, uh, cream blushes, Illamaxca cream blushes are very watery and I like this because it's just so easy. Um, it's easy, but it's also very dewy. You know, um, the Becca cream blush kind of dries I mean, as a cream, but this one, it just stays very dewy. So it looks like this. And these, I found these on the base website. And um, on Sephora, they don't have a whole lot of La Masca products. And actually, I think they're more expensive. So this on the base website was $26.99, which I thought La Masca was a more expensive brand. But, I mean, yeah, so on the bay, shipping is very fast and everything. So just order these on the bay if you want to buy them in Canada so yeah Zygomatic for this one and I got a gleam that they call and the packaging is kind of a little cheap I was expecting something a little more expensive feeling but I mean it's it's still nice so it's just a highlighter looks like this and again this is this is kind of funny it's not as wet as the cream blush it's a lot more creamy but it, it still gives a very dewy look and this highlighter is not too gold, not too frosty, like purpley tone. It's just the perfect, like in the middle. I think it would suit warmer skin tone or cooler skin tone because it's not too gold, not too silver. So you can't really see. I have a few things from MAC. So the first thing that I have is a lipstick. This is a retro matte lipstick in the color All Fired Up. My mom actually got this for me because she got the same one and I really liked it on her. So, And usually colors that look good on my mom don't look good on me and vice versa, but this one looks great on both of us. So as I said, it's a retro matte and it looks very nice. On the camera, it doesn't look the same. It looks more of a fire red, but it's actually more of a raspberry pink, but it's very nice. And I love matte lipsticks. I know some people don't. But, I mean, if I'm going to wear a lipstick, I like it to stay on a long time on my lips. So, it looks like this. The Fix Plus. I just get the travel size because I can just bring it everywhere with me. I like this. And then, and this is something new that I've been trying. Um, this is the Strobe Cream. And I got, again, the small size. Because, actually, this if you buy three small size, it will be more product than the full size, which is 50 ml. And it will be less the same price. So I mean, this is twelve dollars for thirty ml. Gosh, makeup artists also talked about this. So I don't know when he sorry when he says something is good, I kind of want to buy it. <laughs> um, so he says there is antioxidants in there. In this, I'm not. Yeah, that's what he said. But 
it looks very nice. When I'm not wearing any makeup except um, like cream blush, concealer, mascara, this on my skin looks very nice. It just makes my skin look very glowy and just very alive. I have dry skin, so making my skin look alive can be hard sometimes, but this looks very nice. I have it on today underneath of my foundation. I have a few things from It Cosmetics that were actually sent to me. So I'm going to do a full review on these three products. I'm probably going to do like one video featuring all of those. Like a first impression type of video. Um, so this is Your Skin But Better CC Cream, CC Cream with 50 SPF. Also sent me this um, airbrush illuminizer. This is a highlighter. And um, comes a little poof. And the product looks like this. Airbrush illuminizer. Airbrush blush satin. In the color Sweet Cheeks. Um, it got a little messy right here. But it's a very nice color as you can tell. So I got a um, L'Oreal Paris Liner Intense Eyeliner. I already used this, but I'm not a really big eyeliner fan, but I wanted one. I'm going to practice my cat eye because I kind of suck at it, but yeah, this eyeliner is very nice. I use it actually in my waterline, top waterline. I don't know if you're supposed to, but I've been doing it and my eyes have been doing fine. And this is quite inexpensive. It's like seven something. Got the Infallible um, Silky Pencil Eyeliner. So I got it in the shade 230 highlighter. This is not the packaging. It's kind of a rose gold liner. So um, I wanted like a just a like a nude color for my bottom waterline. Very pretty rose gold color. It's very nice on the waterline. It's it's different than just nude and um, it adds a little something. So yeah, I really like this. And again, that was only seven something, and I'll probably get the black version of this because I really like it. It holds pretty nice. Pretty well. Okay, I only have a few things left. I got the Shiseido eyelash curler which someone recommended this to me and I got the Shorimura one and then I didn't really like it because it didn't fit my eye. This one fits my eye really nice but I feel like it, the curl doesn't last as long but I mean I got it. It's better than my cheap one that I had before. It was twenty dollars. Um, yeah, it's great. Maybe it's just my eyelashes and the mascara I've been using. I don't know. But yeah, I got this and then I got to try a waterproof mascara that would keep my curl. I got the CoverGirl Lash Blush Fusion in Waterproof. I don't really like it. I tried this before. I decided to try it again. It's not the best, but we will see. And then, sorry, my chair is making a lot of noise. I got the Girl Meets Pro at Shoppers Drug Mart. It was crazy and expensive crazy and expensive. It was reduced. Uh, it's usually $36. I got it for $20 or $24. can't remember. But it's just a highlighter, liquid highlighter actually. Um, I like it. It's kind of a rose goldy type of color. It's here. I like it again, top of my cheekbones. I really like highlighters. I've discovered a love for them. So yeah. And then um, Shoppers again, I got deodorant. This is my favorite one. It came in a pack. It was only $3.99 for two. So it's the Dove Go Fresh, the one, um, pomegranate one. And I got two things, well, three things, but one I don't have with me from Zora by Cosmetics. I'll talk more about them in a future video, but they're just um, cream eyeshadows. This brand is, as the name says, um, by, um, by all Organic. It's some French biologic. Um, and then I have a brown one. I'll show them in a video very soon. But I'll link down below where you can find this brand. Because you can find it in um, like grocery store. But more healthy grocery store kind of. Anyways, I'll link it down below. But that's pretty much everything I had to show you. I'll wait to film tutorials for you guys. And more videos. I only have 50 seconds on my camera. So please subscribe. Thumbs up. Comment. Anything that you want. Um, request everything. All of my links will be down below. Makeup that I'm wearing wearing will be down below. And then links for ev pretty much everything that I can find will be down below. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, I really will improve my channel. So subscribe. If you want to see more videos. This camera really will help me a lot to film tutorials because before I couldn't really with my iPhone. So I'll do a hair routine, hair video, everything. Room tour, makeup collection coming soon because I changed my room as you can tell. So anyways, now I have 10 seconds left. So thank you for waiting on me for the past month. Um, I will see you in my next one. Bye!